I have a character in the center of the show who has autism. Mm. And that is not something we see on TV right. very much. Right. And so how do I make him fully dimensionalized while being true to people with this condition on this spectrum? Mm -hmm. Well, at the same time, he's representing yep. right. that yeah. condition. Yeah. And Oof. how do I not, it's important that I don't turn him into the 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 magic person with right, autism right. where he's got a condition but he he's fine he just he'll mm -hmm. solve all the problems and how do I be true to his weaknesses and his strengths mm -hmm. and um, it it continues to be a challenge. What if it doesn't make me happy? What if it doesn't make me happy? What if it only makes you happy? You think you think I'm doing this to make me happy? Mm -hmm. I'm not happy. Sean, I'm not close to being happy. And you know what? I am done explaining. I am done bribing. And I am done talking. Okay. Now, let's go. No, no, let's no, go. no, no, no. I, I want to make my own decisions. Do you hear from the, com the, the autistic community a ton or people? Yeah, yeah. We, um, we have, um, I think they're very grateful to have themselves represented on TV. Yeah. I did period. a show called Alphas and we had a, and it was kind of a magic autistic character, mm -hmm. but the performance was so excellent the, the, because it's a superpower show, he had superpower. But the, his normal performance, and we, that community was so interested and, and grateful that we actually okay. yeah. engaged with them and asked them questions. But you do feel like, are you representing the autistic spectrum or this guy? Yes. Right. And the more we did this guy, the better it was. Yes, you know? absolutely. Yeah. yeah, not every autistic person, but this person. Right. It's difficult to fire people. It's difficult right, to fire people you like, even right. if you've got the reason for it. And some mm -hmm. of them take it well, and some of them, no matter what you say to them, and no matter what the truth, they take it personally. Right. Yeah. And it's just, it's not fun. It's not mm -hmm. a fun part of the job, but it is part of the job, and you have to have your attitude. <laughs> well, especially when they've done nothing wrong, right? When yes. it's just a story. Yeah. Because right. then it's like, yeah. that. it rarely happens in the world that you get fired and you didn't do anything wrong. Right. right. Exactly. So that's, that's a really In fact, hard. usually it, it's the opposite because no one would care if the person died if they weren't giving a good performance. Right. So if you're actually... Right. Yeah. Right. Mm -hmm. yeah. 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 I did, this is, wasn't awkward, but I just, uh, the most unusual situation, I had, I had an actor come, because you also get actors with opportunities and you want to encourage those opportunities mm -hmm. and I never yeah. want to, I mean, if, if their opportunity was on another show, I might say, okay. but you know, they. I did have an actor come to me once and say he wants off the show because he wants to take a job in the White House. Oh, yeah, yeah. okay. That was, that was, yeah, That's so. a yes. Did you say no way? Well, it's funny because I, I say it was very early. It was Cal Penn, and yeah. he did no. go work in the White House for, for I think, two years. But it was like, I, I said, yeah, and then I said, sure, we'll work. He gave me really great notice, lots of time for us to give him a really good story right. to send him off. But as soon as he was done with me, I get a phone call from his agent or manager saying, don't worry about it, it's not gonna happen. He's, he's an actor, he'll change his mind. Wow. He, he's gonna recognize how much what the money difference is and he's not, there's <laughs> wow. no way he's going. <laughs> and he went. Wow. You know. My IMDb page, the mm -hmm. first item on it is boy eating crackers in the movie Meatballs. <laughs> wow. <laughs> Wait, really? And really. I, one of my writers on House added that, but it is accurate. Wow. <laughs> I was attending that summer camp wow. when they filmed that movie, and what I learned was, don't really eat the crackers. <laughs> oh, because <laughs> they're gonna do. You learned to pretend. Yeah, I learned to pretend. Yes. Yeah. 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 Mm -hmm. yeah. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. Hi, I'm Peter Morgan. Hi, I'm Courtney Kemp. Thanks for watching. Thanks for watching. Thanks for watching. Thank you for watching the Hollywood Reporter on YouTube.